really work on your communication skills. The thing that's helped me a lot is learning to communicate simply the potential and the opportunities. I'm the IT manager for sustainability, currently working at Nestle. In my role, I'm taking all my experience that I have from working in IT to help Nestle achieve some really ambitious sustainability commitments. So working to reduce greenhouse gas emissions, to enable packaging sustainability, and to advance regenerative agriculture and ensure sustainable sourcing. And my job's to apply what we can from information technology, data and analytics to help enable those commitments. In my role, I get to talk to hundreds, even thousands of other employees. So I'm also educating them on the potential of technology to play a role in sustainability and hopefully influencing them to have more of an impact as well. Because of the important role that businesses can play, I think it'd be really powerful if sustainability, so environmental impact and social impact was really taken into account up front in businesses' key decisions. So that all of the products and services in the business models are designed to be sustainable from the outset. And that's the vision that really guides me in my work. So what I learned from my course with CISL is that leadership comes in many forms. I think before that I had quite a traditional view of leadership and I've really learned that all styles of leadership are valid, particularly in the area of sustainability, where we do need to harness and work with diverse groups. My personal leadership has come from finding my purpose. Uh, and really listening to my passion. And I think that's probably true for a lot of people. And then I think being effective and having impact comes from being a really good communicator. So working hard on being clear and positive. Some of the challenges that we face really are challenges. And I think it's really important to stay positive so that others engage with you and you can attract others to work on sustainability. I try hard to be really inclusive. CISL really opened my eyes to the tight interconnection between environmental impact and social impact. So I really think about who else's opinion we should collect in order to come up with relevant solutions. I really try and stay focused on achieving positive outcomes. And to do that, I'm very organized to make sure that we make progress. And personally, I'm really motivated by driving positive change. So I think a lot about what information, what insights people need in order to change their action and come with us. I think the first ally was the CIO at Nestle that recognized the opportunity for the role and created a role dedicated to driving sustainability from IT. But secondly, surprisingly, I found a lot of allies across the industry. So I've made a lot of really useful connections with peers in other companies, in consumer goods, in the food industry, and we've provided each other a lot of support because we're all working in the very new areas. Mm -hmm. We're working together to try and set industry standards and work on some solutions that would actually benefit the whole industry. I would say get started and learn on the job, learn with what you're doing, and then also really work on your communication skills. The thing that's helped me a lot is learning to communicate simply the potential and the opportunities. People forget to explain why. The thing that I've learned is always, always start with the reasons, start with why, because so often the conversations jump to how, um, and it's the why that really motivates people to be part of this with us. So I think working in sustainability right now, there is a great deal of change and uncertainty. And so I've got used to accepting that and getting comfortable with it. And the way that I handle it is 
I try and simplify the area that we focus on where I know we can have an impact and move that forward and help others do that too. It really broadened my understanding of sustainability and brought me into an understanding of the social impact side of it as well. But more importantly, it gave me the confidence to take the skills and experience that I already had from being an IT manager and apply those to be a change agent in sustainability. So I think all of the work that we did in groups and all of the leadership labs that I did really gave me the confidence to make the shift and set myself up to lead in this area.